hey you guys and welcome back to my channel so today i have a walgreens video for you guys these deals started on sunday december 12th and they are good up until saturday december 18th but before i get into these deals if you are new to my channel and you are not currently subscribed to me i would really appreciate if you will go ahead and click that red subscribe button along with the notification bell so that you will be aware of each and every time that i upload new videos with that being said let's go ahead and get right into these deals okay guys so in this transaction i used two boosters i used a digital booster get five dollars in walgreens cash when you spend twenty dollars and then i also used a paper booster get eight dollars in walgreens cash when you spend 35. so as you guys can see i have some huggies colgate gillette tide bounty and charmin so we're going to go ahead and start with the gillette shave gel so I purchased two of the Gillette foam shave gels and these are buy one get one 50% off and they are priced at $2.99. So one will ring up at $2.99, your second one will ring up half off at $1.49. The deal is when you buy two, you will receive $4 in Walgreens cash rewards. So you're going to want to purchase, oh, so $2.99 plus $1.49 is $4.48. And then since you purchased two, you will receive back that $4 in Walgreens cash. So $4.48 minus the $4 in Walgreens cash, that's gonna bring your total down to 48 cents for both, or it's gonna make each one just 24 cents. Also guys, I want to state that I will have a Google document linked in the description box below, just in case you guys wanna take a look at that, print it off and maybe take it to the store with you if you plan on doing some of these deals. So 24 cents for each of these Gillette foam shave gels. And then next up, I went ahead and I grabbed two of the Colgate Max Fresh toothpaste. And these are priced at Walgreens for $2.99 this week. The deal is when you buy two, you will receive $4 in Walgreens cash rewards. So you want to, you're gonna to wanna to purchase two at $2.99 and that's gonna bring your total to $5.98. We have two $1 Colgate digital coupons on the Walgreens app. So $5.98 minus that $2 in digital coupons, that's gonna bring your total down to $3.98. And then since you purchased two, you will receive back that $4 in Walgreens cash, making both of these toothpaste completely free, plus a two cent moneymaker. And then I went ahead and I grabbed three packages of the Huggies diapers. These are the little movers, the size four. And these are priced at Walgreens for two for 20. And then the deal is when you buy three, you will receive a $5 store reward. So as you guys can see, I purchased three and each package rung up at $10. So for all three packages, it brought my total to $30. We have a four off of two digital Huggies coupon on the Walgreens app. And then we also have a $2 off of one digital coupon on the Walgreens app. So that's a total of $6 in digital coupons. So $30 minus the $6 in digital coupons, that will bring your total down to $24. And when you buy three, you will receive back a $5 store coupon. And I did receive that $5 store coupon right here. So $24 minus his $5 store coupon, that brought my total down to just $19. Then if you check your Fetch Rewards app, Fetch Rewards has a rebate for $3 back when you purchase any Huggies uh, diaper. Make sure you do read the description because it's gonna tell you what is excluded. So you will get $3 back for purchasing one. And then I also had a second Huggies rebate on the Fetch Rewards app to where you can get back $5 when you buy two. So for me, I got back a total of $8 from Fetch Rewards. So $19 minus the $8 that I got back from Fetch Rewards, that brought my total down to just $11 for all three packages, or it makes each package just $3.67. And then lastly, I went ahead and I grabbed two of the Tide Pod Packs. Uh, I grabbed some Charmin Tissue, the six equals 24. And then I grabbed the Bounty Essentials Paper Tiles, the six equals eight. And the deal with this is that when you buy four, you will receive a $6 registry reward. Now, one thing I want to go ahead and mention is that I did not receive my $6 registry reward. All of these items qualify, but I did not receive it. Um, there was nothing wrong with the register with the Catalina machine because this uh, right here printed out this store coupon printed out for me. So it wasn't anything wrong with the machine. 
Not exactly sure why the $6 registry reward didn't print for me, but I did go ahead and fill out that Catalina form so that I can get my $6 mailed to me. So just to let you guys know that. So I grabbed two of the Tide Packs, Charmin and the Bounty. And these items are priced at $5.25. When you buy four, you will receive a $6 registry reward. So $5.25 times four is $21. If you go to the PG Good Everyday website, you can print off a $3 off of two coupon for the Tide Pods. They also have a three off of two coupon for the Tide Liquid, but strangely, I, I clipped that coupon and I tried to print it, but it did not print for me. That has never happened and it's still on the website, but for some reason, it is not it didn't print for me so let me know if you go to the pg good everyday website and you try to print that tie liquid coupon let me know if it prints for you because i really want to print that because i need some more tie liquid but it just didn't want to print for me so let me know down in the comment section if that coupon printed for you we have a one dollar digital coupon on the walgreens app for the charmin and then we also have a one dollar digital coupon on the walgreens app for the bounty so total in coupons i used five dollars so $21 minus the $5 in digital coupons, that brought my total down to just $16. And then when you buy four, you will receive back a $6 registry reward, which will bring your total down to just $10 for all four products, or it'll make each product just $2.50 each. And then I also was watching Dunn's Deals. I watched her Walgreens video on YouTube, and she mentioned the Google Pay app. I didn't even know that the Google Pay app had like offers to where you can get cash back. So shout out to Dunn's Deals because this credit goes 100% to her. So I downloaded the Google Pay app and on there you will have to sign up and then choose the offers that you would like at the, for the stores that you would like to shop at. And then for Walgreens, Walgreens has a $10 cash back when you spend $25. So the minimum has to be $25. Uh, in order to get the offer, you have to make sure that you add a card. Whatever card that you add to that account, that is the card that you need to make sure that you shop with when you do your shopping at Walgreens. There are other stores on there that you can scan through and you can add whatever offers that, you, that you'd like. But for me, I added the Walgreens offer and I did spend $25.00. Um, once again, this is my first time using the Google Pay app, so I'm still trying to learn about it. But I did add my card. I added the offer before I went to the store. Um, I added the card. I used the card that I added to my Google Pay account. I used that to pay for this transaction. I did spend at least $25. So, um, as of right now, I have not gotten credited the $10 yet. But um, as I was reading it says usually the money will make it to your Google Pay account within minutes or sometimes it takes up to a week. So right now I'm just waiting. And then if I don't receive anything within seven days, then I will submit a request. So right now I am just waiting, but I'm pretty sure that I'm probably going to get the $10. Um, but we will see and I will keep you guys updated on my community tab on YouTube. So again, shout out to Dunn's Deals. Um, for mentioning the Google Pay app. I will have the Google Pay app linked in the description box below just in case you guys want to go ahead and check it out and sign up because I think that that's a nice way to get $10, especially if you know that you're going to be spending $25 at Walgreens anyway. So again, I will have that linked in the description box below for you. So with that being said, you guys, let me go ahead and show you all my receipts. So as you guys can see, both of the Gillette Shave Foam Gels rung up at buy one, get one 50% off. The first one at $2.99, second one at $1.49. All three of my packs of Huggies rung up at $10 each, so $30 total. Bounty Charmin in both of my Tide rung up at $5.25 each. Both of my Colgate rung up at $2.99, so $5.98. There's my Paper Booster, get $8 in Walgreens cash when you spend $35. Um, I had no issues. All of my digital coupons came off. So the $3 for the Tide, the $4 and $2 digital for the Huggies, one dollar, both of the $1 digitals for the Colgate, and then both of my $1 digitals for the Charmin and the Bounty. So as you guys can see, it brought my subtotal to $48.46. Now I did use the pay in store method because I wanted my out of pocket to be a little bit cheaper. 
So I did use $20 in Walgreens cash. And then I paid the $28.46 using my, my Walgreens MasterCard. And then when you look down here, it says earned this visit. I earned back $22.69. So again, my total came out to be $48.46. And then I earned back $22.69. So of that $22.69, $4 came from the Gillette. $4 came from the Colgate. $5 came from me spending $20. And then the $8 came from me spending $25, which was my paper booster. And then the $1.69 is the extra Walgreens points that you get. So $48.46 minus the $22.69 in Walgreens cash rewards that I received back. That brought my total down to $25.77. And then I got back my $5 store coupon for the Huggies diapers. And even though my $6 registry reward did not print for the Tide, Charmin, and Bounty, like I said, I did go ahead and submit my request to Catalina. Every time I submit that request, you guys, they always send me my registry reward in the mail. So I'm just going to go ahead and include that $6 in this transaction, even though it didn't print for me. But again, I know that I'm going to receive it. So in registry, well, $5 in store coupon and then $6 in the registry reward, that's a total of $11. So $25.77 minus the $11 in rewards. That brought my total down to $14.77. Then from Fetch Rewards, I got back a total of $8 for the um, Huggies diapers along with some extra Fetch Rewards points. So I got back a total of eight eighty three hundred 8,300 points, which is $8.30. So $14.77 minus the $8.30 that I got back from Fetch Rewards. That brought my total down to $6.47. Now, you guys, once I receive that $10 back from Google Pay, that will make this entire transaction completely free plus a $3.53 moneymaker. So again, I want to go ahead and include that $10 in this transaction even though I haven't received it yet. Um, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go ahead and include this. If I don't receive that $10, then the total cost for this would be $6.47, which is still a fantastic price to pay for all of this stuff. So again, I will keep you guys updated on my YouTube community post to let you guys know if I received it or not. But in the meantime, once again, I will have the Google Pay linked in the description box below. So that is going to be it for this video, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys are getting from Walgreens this week or what you guys have already gotten from Walgreens this week. Don't forget to submit your receipts to Fetch Rewards. If you are not using Fetch Rewards, I will have that linked in the description box below along with my code on the screen for you. When you sign up using my code, you will receive 2,000 points, which is $2. So again, this is going to be it, you guys, and I hope that you all enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.